happy Saturday again, my YouTube subscribers. Today I'm at St. James's Church in Bicknell. Uh, I'm here to explore this reportedly haunted church and graveyard. Um, it's not a very big place, but it's very historic. I believe it was built in the, the Saxon times. Um, these days it's hardly used. I believe it's used a couple of times a year. I think one's Chris Dingle and one is Easter service. Uh, beyond that, it's left physically abandoned. Um, we're currently probably about a mile and a half from any civilization and all that surrounds this church is a wooded area, woods everywhere. So it's very quiet. There's nothing that can encroach on us. So join me today as we do this haunted explore of Bickner Church and I hope that we can pick something up. Um, so, as I said, please join me and I'll speak to you again soon. All the best now. Okay, so I think what we'll do, we'll have a walk around the churchyard itself just to get a feel for the place and to make sure nobody's here with us or nobody physical in any case certainly don't mind spiritual and then we'll do some communications within the front entrance of the church and see if we can pick anything up today all right okay let's leave that camera going there for a little while and we'll see if it picks anything up i've put the emf down next to the main door itself so that should sound if there's any Think that approaches it. As you can see, a very old, I believe it's Saxon built originally. Um, so I'm not sure the exact age of the property, but obviously, a certainly a smaller church than I visited last week. But indeed, it's certainly freaky. Um, as I said, it's left abandoned most of the year it's used a few times a year I believe Chris Dingle and a few things like that I would imagine there'll be an Easter service there's some movement over there and surrounding the churchyard itself it's just really wooded areas as I drove into the small country lane to it to access the church it's just a mile and a half of deep thick woods so it's certainly isolated. That grave obviously is quite well uh, looked after and attended to. So obviously people do visit this to maintain the graves of their dead beloved ones. Okay, so that's really it on the churchyard itself. But as I said, we're here to see if we can do some spirit communication and see if anyone's not quite passed over yet and maybe wants to talk to us this morning we'll just have a look at the side of the church because it doesn't appear to be a pathway and it looks like it's quite overgrown I certainly like to be able to get into it maybe I can get some pictures of what it actually looks like and post there's movement through them woods I keep hearing something moving but maybe it's an animal And as you can see, there's not much of the church. The back is definitely brambled over and heavy growth. But a lovely old flint place. Let's just have a peer around the corner. Certainly as you can see, there's no way I'm gonna get down there too far. It's certainly over overgrown. Okay, let's have a look at the other side of the church then we can get back and try and do some communications as you can see the grass hasn't been cut for some time so it's not often visited I think what we'll do we'll move that static camera just to face inward at the door I think Bear with me a moment. Okay, so there we go. There's movement over there to my left. We'll go and have an, an investigate that in a moment and see what we can get. Right, let's have a look. Maybe what I could do, actually, 
let's come back into the inner we'll put that down there and then I can get my spirit box out and we can start that off and see what we can get comes up we'll leave that running on the door as you can see down there I've got the an EMF box there so that will help out okay can I ask is there anybody here with me today that would like to communicate with me could you give me some sign of your presence maybe and obviously this is the actual path in well if you can call it a path it's actually just a walk through the field itself and obviously I've parked over there and as you can see there's just fields and woods surrounding the church itself so there's not a lot to St James's Church in Bicknor but nevertheless we're here to try and communicate with the dead that's the reason we do this is there anybody that wants to talk to me today please Could you tell me if you're buried here? You died in the town maybe, or in the village? Could you give me some sign that you're here? Obviously not too much to explore. Let's uh, go back to the entrance and we'll see if we can get anything. Maybe I could try a voice recorder actually, I haven't tried that for a while. And see if anything wants to come through to us. Okay. Let's leave that down there, recording away. We'll bring the light in. And we'll see if we can communicate to something. I don't know why this phone's gone so quiet all of a sudden. Uh, oh, it is trying to communicate. It appears the Bluetooth app is interfering with it. I think we'll turn this off. Could you possibly give me your name, please? Sorry. Was that knock on this door? Or should we knock back? I said sorry. This is St James's Church in Bicknor. There was something coming from that door then. What did you just say? Behind me. Who's behind me? Who's behind me? I've knocked on your door. If there's someone that haunts this church, please come and knock back to me. Chair. Did you want me to sit down? Is that what you're asking? Did you want me to sit down? Please confirm. I'm more than happy to. Okay. Let's let's sit down and see if we can communicate a bit. Bear with me. Let's get this placed. It's certainly a little quiet at the moment, but we'll see if we can pick things up a little. Okay, let's try this. Okay, I'm here with love and respect. And I'm hoping that somebody can... I hear you. Thank you. I can hear you too. Would you be able to tell me your name, maybe? Would you be able to knock on the door to let me know that you're here? Phone. Phone. Yes, it is a phone. I'm glad you noticed that. Could you talk into that phone, please? Could you give me some sense that you're here, maybe? 
Could you knock on the door? Could you do that for me, please? Let's try the voice recorder again. Is there anybody that um, haunts or visits these grounds, please? Light. Light. Can you see my light? What? what? Not sure the relevance of what. Can you see my lights? Could you confirm, please? Could you maybe approach the meter on the floor, the little black box? It will light up and make a small sound if it knows you're here. Possessed. Who's possessed, please? We've had possessed on a few occasions on my night explores. I hope you're not saying that I should be possessed. Could you give me your name at least? Or could you tell me if you're a man or a woman? Dangerous. Hammer. What's dangerous and where's the hammer? Could I possibly knock on this door? Would you knock back to me, please? Adam. Adam. Is that your name, Adam? Is that your name? No. No. Then what is your name, please? I think they're playing me with these words tonight. Let's do a few more knocks on this door. Camera. Camera. You know I'm recording you, don't you? Is that why you won't show yourself or talk to me? Is it because I'm recording? I can hear something in this church. Could you come and knock on the door for me, please? I know there's spirits here. It's been reported. I'm here because of that fact. So could you possibly just show me that you're here? Copy me doing this, please. Can you knock back? It's very strange, my phone case keeps moving. And it's not on an angle, it's not on a slant. It just keeps moving. Old soldier. Soldier, is there a soldier buried here? Is there a spirit of a soldier here? Or were Coffin. you... Coffin. So he was buried here, is that what you're telling me? Are you telling me he was buried here, please? I appreciate your communications. Let's see if we've caught anything on the voice recorder. Is there anybody that haunts or visits these grounds, please? Let's move this a bit and just hope. Light. light. Can you see my light? What? Not sure. The relevance of what? Buried. Can you see my lights? I see you. You see me. Confirm, please. Thank you. Let's stop this. So we've had a soldier, we've had a coffin and buried. So that does tell me that there is a soldier buried here. Am I correct? Are you the soldier? Are you the soldier, please? Definitely communicating. I just need something a bit Who is she? firmer. Dangerous. Who is she in dangerous? Who is he? Who is he? I don't know. We seem to have a lot of um, visitors today, don't we? So are you saying there's a woman with me and possibly a man? Are they in, in, in this little area with me? Maybe they're sitting on the other bench. Maybe they're watching me. Maybe they're listening.
Definitely some strange noises out in the graveyard itself. I can hear them. And that case, look at that case. That case is moving on its own. Hope you can see that. Very strange. That phone's going to fall in a minute. And that case is being moved deliberately because it doesn't move. Are you going to make that phone fall over? I can see you moving the case. You're clearly here with me. And I thank you for that. If you knock that phone over. I hear you. I know you hear me. You've already told me. Can you knock this phone over? Can you move it so it falls over, please? Very strange. I keep catching it out of the corner of my eye. The case is just, it keeps opening. Oh, there it goes. So, <laughs> thank you very much for that. Just caught that in time. Don't want to break my okay. new phone. Okay, thank you. I really appreciate that. You've just proved to me that you're here. Father. Father. Surgeon. Surgeon. Can you give me anything more specific, please? Are you a father? Is that what you're telling me? I believe you're the soldier. I believe you're buried here. Is there anything else that you can tell me, please? Could you still approach this light, please? Could you make this light go off? I know you're here, the way the phone went. Maybe you could talk into this little box for me. If I ask you a few questions, you think you could reply back to me, please? Firstly, are you a male or a female? How old are you, please? How old are you? Neil. Neil. I am in the right place to Neil. I'm in a church. Crow noises going on out there. Can you tell me your name, please? Could you guide me to where you're buried? You've told me you're a soldier. I believe you're buried here by what you've told me. Six. Six. What relevance is six, please? Alan. Alan. That was my father's name, Alan. Who's in hell, please? Certainly not my father, he's a lovely man. Let's see if anything's coming through. Pop into this little box for me. If I ask you a few questions, you think you could reply back to me, please? Firstly, are you a male? Or a female. If you see anything, how old are you? Let me know. How old are you? Neil. I am in the right place to Neil. I'm in a church. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe what? Maybe you'll show yourself to me? Crow noises going on out there. I can hear. Thank you. Is there some... Can you tell me your name, please? Let's turn this off a minute. Demon. Are you telling me there's a demon in the church? There's movement within the church. I can hear it. I could hear footsteps. Could you come closer to this door, maybe? Could you knock on it? 
I'm hoping you can. Like. Light, yes, I know, thank you. Or are you, are you telling me you see a light? Do you see a light? There's definitely some movement in there. I keep hearing little thuds. Can someone approach this door, please, and just tap on it, maybe? Could you guide them to the door? If this is you, if you're the gentleman that's talking to me, could you guide whatever is inside to the door to communicate, please? Hot. Are you hot? Could you knock on this door like this, please? Could you respond? I need you to respond Miss. to me. Miss. You've been moving my phone. Surely there's something else you can do. If you're capable of moving a phone like that, you're capable of doing other things. Let's try recording again. I'll leave the recorder there, just to see. Or maybe I could actually put it down at the door because it can actually, oh, that was me, I do apologize. If you're here, could you, maybe approach either one of these boxes on the floor please because that will show me that you're close movement again in the church I know that somebody's in there or not somebody a spirit possibly could you possibly come close to me could you show me that you're here? I'm hoping the microphone picks it up. Obviously it's not as good as a human hearing, but it does pick some things up occasionally. Can you knock on this door please? Walking out there. There's certainly bits going on. Just need them to show themselves. Bruce. Bruce. Who's Bruce, please? I appreciate all the communication. If Bruce is here, come forward. If it's Adam, ask Adam to come forward. More walking out there. Whoever's out there, come in. Come in and sit on that bench. Come in. Talk to me. I think it's all a matter of time. I think you just need to let it build. And then you start getting communication. Am I correct that there's someone here with me? Could you confirm that please? If I put this phone back up as it was, do you think you could do that again? Move it again? I'm trying to listen because I keep thinking I hear things in there. And I don't want to talk over it just in case it gets picked up. Certainly a very old church, and I'd be surprised if there's not anything haunting this place. If it's a Saxon church, it's many, many hundreds of years old. Why are you here? I'm here to try and communicate with you, to talk to you. I thought you'd welcome a visitor. You clearly don't get many visitors in this place.
Could you talk to me? Could you show yourself, please? I appreciate your communication, but I'd like to also see something physical if I can. Could you do that for me? Up. What's up, please? Do I look up? Do I look up? Are you okay? I'm fine, thank you very much. It's very nice of you to ask me. Are you okay? Can I ask, are you okay? Bite. Bite. Who's gonna bite, please? Certainly nothing on me. Prison. Prison? Do you feel imprisoned in this place? Do you feel trapped? Maybe you could go to the light that you asked earlier. Maybe if you see that light, you should approach it. Maybe you should go into it. Can you see a light? Let's leave that tumbling away and we'll um, just have a little... Psychic. Psychic? Are you psychic? Okay. I think what we're going to do, we're going to have a go at this night vision. See if we can pick anything up on it. Thank you. Let's have a little wander. Is there anybody that can show their selves, please? You never can tell, night vision sometimes pick things up that generally you wouldn't see with the light on so we'll have a little walk up there see if anything wants to show itself could something come forward please and maybe show yourself I can hear the ghost box speaking away. Hopefully you'll pick something up with this night vision. Okay, so <laughs> thank you once again for joining me today. Um, there's been a few small things going on. Not sure if I've picked too much up, but I will see that in the editing. So, in any case, thank you for joining me today. He's still very chatty and what still... What year is it? It's 2022. Can you tell me what year you think it is, please? I'm lost. You're lost. Can I help you? Can I help you, please? Can I guide you? I'm happy to communicate with you. Just give me Maybe. some sign that you're here. Maybe. Please just come forward and talk to me. I would really appreciate it. Speak. I am speaking. Could you do something behind this door for me, please? Who is she? Who is she? I don't know. Is there a she with me? 
Could you tell me that, please? It's very nice that you're communicating with me, but I would like more if you could. Basement. Basement. Is there a basement to this church? Are you in the basement, maybe? Could you approach this door and knock on it? Could you possibly do that? Could you do that for me? Could you knock on this door while I film it, please? Could you do this for me? Could you knock back? I would really appreciate it if you could. Could you copy me? Drip. Drip. Please come and copy me. Do that on the door. Not back, even lightly. If you're a male, knock on the door. If you're female, knock on the door, please. Are you okay? I'm fine, thank you very much. It's very nice of you to keep asking me if I'm okay. And yes, I am. It's very polite of you. It's a beautiful old church, but as I say, it's very quiet. I'm not sure if it's majorly active or just, as I said before, it's luck of the draw. Sometimes these places are really active. Scratch. Scratch, you've already said scratch. Is somebody gonna come and scratch me? Who is he? You're repeating yourself. First. First. Or was that Hurst? I don't know. If I stand with my back against the door, could you maybe tap on it or communicate with me? Could you approach the door? Leave here. You want me to leave here? Why do you want me to leave? I'm upsetting you by being here. Could you talk to me, please? Could you just tell me your name? I'm listening because I keep hearing little things in the church. Neil. Yes, I'm in the right place, uh -huh. Neil. You seem to be talking more now. Show me something. Can you approach the front of this church so my camera will pick you up. There's a camera outside recording. Yes. You can, please do. Please come forward. Move in front of this door. Or this archway. Show me you're here. Arthur. Arthur. I think we've had Arthur before. Is this you, Arthur? Are you with me now? Okay, I think what we'll do, we'll leave it there for tonight. Um, not too much going on, but certainly Louis. very interesting, and they're still Hammer. still talking away. Very interesting explore. Um, very nice old Saxon church. Obviously, very quiet, so there's been nothing to spoil 
any sound or possibly any communication. So hopefully I've picked something up during the edit. Um, so thank you once again for joining me this week. It's really nice having you with me. Um, so please leave a like or leave a comment. And I will see you again shortly on my next Explore. You take care of yourselves. God bless. Bye-bye now. Thank you.